We are just a little more than an hour away from the kickoff time. As you see that countdown clock right here, um, we are looking at the Tokyo Olympics floating rings. They weigh 69 tons. They've actually wow. been in place since January of 2020. And you'll see the Olympics right here on WPTV News Channel 5 for the next two weeks. Oh, that's right. More than 600 American athletes are in Tokyo right now, hoping to bring home a gold medal, including Jessica Ramsey from Boynton Beach, shot putter. We'll be talking about our local athletes you can cheer on, but we do need to talk about this. COVID is already dashing some of those dreams for some Olympians. Top competitors across several sports are now in isolation after testing positive. Most recently, beach volleyball player Taylor Crabb for our country announced he tested positive after arriving in Tokyo. Gymnast Kara Eaker also testing positive and another gymnast Leanne Wong is in isolation after being identified as a close contact. Team USA basketball teams are also losing key players due to COVID. A 3x3 three three women's player Katie Lou Samuelson tested positive. Zach Levine missed the team's flight to Tokyo after being placed under health and safety protocols. Now, in total, there have been more than 100 COVID cases associated with the Summer Games. This is according to the Tokyo Olympics COVID database. The Games kick off right here on WPTV. And again, those opening ceremonies an hour 26 minutes away. There we go.